Hi dear friends, this is Dr. Karthik, Master Teacher in RDA and MDS. So here we are going to see one of the very important topic, but a very small topic that is G generals and piezo lemurs. What are the various important concepts and facts which you have to know here? A to Z we are going to completely discuss about this. Right, what is G generals? It is a traditional engine driven instrument which is available in six sizes, starting from size 1 to size 6. And generally it has a non-cutting tip. This is a non-cutting tip, but it has a lateral cutting part. Available from size 1 to size 6. And how do you know whether it is a size 1 or size 6? And if you see the number of rings, if it has only one ring, it is a size 1. And if it has a 6 rings, it is a size 6. And it has tip diameter of 0.5. And size 2 which has a tip diameter of 0 0.7, 0 0.9, 1.1 and 1.3, 1.5. So they may ask you, just give an image and they may ask you what is the tip diameter of the particular instrument as an image based question. So you have to check the number of rings. So if it is a size 6, the tip diameter is 1.5. So it is very easy, it is increased by 0.2. Right, starting from 0.5 and end by 1.5. So what is the use of this GG drills? And whether it is a low speed hand piece or high speed hand piece, it is used. So generally it is used in a low speed hand piece which rotates at the speed of 752,500 rpm. 1500 rpm. That is rotation per minute. And it is used for widening of the canal orifice. After you done the access opening, so to widen the canal orifice so that your aeronautic instrument can go easily without any fracture. So it reduces the septic fatigue. Right. So number one, it used for widening the canal orifice. And number two, it removes the lingual shoulder. So what is this lingual shoulder? Lingual shoulder is nothing but it is a projection which starting from the lingual surface of the anteriors by removing the lingual shoulder it widens the canal orifice right. you have various sizes from size 1 to size 6 as I told you and where these instruments should be stuck okay. because GG drills number 5 and number 6 which has a large tip diameter around 1.3 to 1.5 GG has 5 size have tip diameter of 1.3 and the 6 has tip diameter of 1.5 because of the huge tip diameter it just stopped on the walls of the axis cavity and GG4 just below the canal orifice or the starting point of the canal orifice GG3 you can up, go up to mid canal region and 2 you can use just up to the beginning of canal curvature and one because the tip diameter is very smaller, it has a very fragile instrument you can use with a low speed hand piece up to the road canal. Right, so these are the various things which you can again know for multiple choice questions. They may ask you oh, these instruments should be used up to what? These instruments should be used for GG5 or GG3, they can be used up to what part of the road canal. For this, you have to have an idea about where it should be stuck and where the instrument fracture. Generally, GG drills fracture which occurs between the shank and the shaft at here. So because the instrument fracture which occurs here, we can easily retrieve the instrument. But if you see the endonautic files, the endonautic files generally fracture at the tip, 2 to 3 millimeter, then the retrieval is very difficult. But here, because the fracture which occurs here, so we have a huge length of the instrument, so retrieval is easier from the root canal of the case of GG drills. Let's see the multiple choice question. They asked in the past exams from the GG drill, one of the very important topic. Right? So gauge blood and drill is so they're given option at flexible and inflexible. So first of all you have to know whether it is a flexible or inflexible. GG drills are made up of stainless steel so it is an inflexible instrument. So you can eliminate the option A and B because both are given as a flexible. The second one, you have to know whether it is a low speed or high speed. Obviously, it is low speed which rotates at the speed of 752, 1500. So, you can go for option C as an answer for this question. Right. So, the thing is like we studied about G drill which is a inflexible. 
then it is a flexible one. So the GG drills, if it is available in a flexible, then it is called as flexo gates. GG drills are made up of stainless steel, but flexo gates, which is made available in nickel titanium. As you know, nickel titanium has the very best property called as super elasticity. Right, it has a very good flexibility so that you can easily make the flexor gates enter into the root canal which rotates at 360 degree which can easily and efficiently eliminates the debris from the root canal that is the use of the flexor gates okay right so next is what is helpful in making radicular access after entry right they are asking about which is used for widening the canal if I very simple question right g generals right and the next question is about the maximum head diameter of ISO gauge blood and drill 1 is equal to 2 right so as I told you GG drills 1 which has a tip diameter of 0 0.5 so they are asking which file has same tip diameter which endo file has same tip diameter right if you see the 50 size file 50 size 5 what is the tip diameter for that you have to divide with 100 so the answer is 0 0.5 so that is equivalent to the gg drill size 1 so 50 size 5 tip diameter is equivalent to the size 1 gate cylinder and what is the shape of the gate cylinder or head of the gate cylinder drill which is available in a flame shape right right so this is the things which you have to know for GG drills the next topic is about piezo ringers piezo ringers which looks gate cylinder drill but both are not the same how do you differentiate a GG drills from the piezo ringers many students have confusion here ok it is very simple and if you see the GG drills which has the head like this very small head but piezo ringers if you see it has a very large large head so the GG drills which is used for winding the canal orifice, piezo remover which is used to remove the gutta pocha from the root canal and because it removes the gutta pocha from the root canal you can place the post easily mean it create post space preparation right so that is a major purpose of piezo remover and again it is available from size 1 to size 6 if you see the ring you can able to identify size 1 to size 6 and the tip diameter of piezo ringer is something different from the GG drills and here size 1 piezo ringer which starts from 0 0.7, 0 0.9, 1.1, 1.3, 1.5, 1 and 1.7 the size 6 piezo ringer which has the tip diameter of 1.7 but size 1 piezo ringer which has the tip diameter of 0 0.7 then in GG drills it's starting from 0.5 to 1.5. So these are the difference of tip diameter for the GG drills and piezo ringers. Right, let's see some multiple choice question which was asked in previous exams for the topic of piezo ringers. Right, what is the use of piezo ringer? First option to remove the lingual shoulder of anterior teeth, it is done with GG drills. Right, to enlarge root canal orifice, yes, GG drills. Post space preparation. To remove gutta puncture, yes, both are used of piezo ringer. Then which option I can go for? It removes the gutta puncture for what purpose? It removes the gutta puncture for post space preparation. So our final thing is post space preparation, right? So now we can go for this option for the post space preparation. And again, the most suitable instrument to remove gutta puncture from the root canal, yes, very good. Piezo ringer is the answer. Bar the brooch which are used for extricate the pulp and these both are not used in the root canal space right so these are the various things which you have to know related to the gg drills and piezo ringers so finally what is the take home message from this particular topic so we have here three set of instruments gg drills flexo gates and piezo ringers gg drills and flexo gates both are nearly same except the flexo gates which is made up of nickel titanium GG drills which is made up of stainless steel which is a inflexible but flexo gauge is a flexible instrument the GG drills which is available from size 1 to size 6 which rotates at the speed of 750 to 1500 rpm which is a low speed 
and size 1 which starts from the tip diameter of 0.5 and size 6 which has a tip diameter of 1.5 again coming to the piezo remover piezo remover again starts from point size 1 to size 6 and size 1 which starts at the tip diameter of 0.7 and size 1 which has the tip diameter of 1.7 GG drills which is used for to widening the canal orifice piezo removers which are used to remove the gutta percha from the road canal for the post space preparation so these are the various things which you have to go for tech home message. Thank you. Have a good day. Bye.